Hello guys, I'm testing a new ROM that I just flashed. It's called uh, Clean Note 2.0, and I'll put a link on my um, description where you can download it and you can see all the features that it has. It's basically a very uh, stock looking ROM, there's no things or anything crazy about it. And, uh, it's based on LPA uh, ICS ROM, which was just released on June 12th. He just posted it today, and I decided to try it. And it looks very smooth, very clean. I'm missing the stock kernel, which I believe is chain fire, and yeah, nothing crazy. So let's run some benchmarks. I just restarted once, just to make sure everything was good. Let's do a quick uh, quadrant for you guys. After this, I'll run a. Uh, a base mark and then I'll run one of my favorite tests which is the MAME Reloaded running after Werner 2 because usually ROMs that tend to lag there or not so much ROM but the kernel so I always end up using Franco R5 because of that but we shall see how this one looks I like clean ones like this I don't like um, a lot of uh, crazy things added to the ROMs if I want to change anything, I'll rather change it myself. But you know, everybody has different opinions on that. And I have like three or four more to test, so just giving you a quick idea on how it performs. Okay, so that's. 4,442 points. Uh, I believe I normally score about 4,700, but that's with uh, Franco 5, so which is probably where the difference is here. And everything looks very normal to uh, for a stock one. So let's go back here and let's do a quick test of uh, base mark. Let's see how 3D performance looks. You guys have seen this before, haven't you? But just to make it better, let's put it like this. The highest score that I have here is about 29 point something, but that's when I overclock everything. Otherwise, when it's running stuck, I usually get around 21 or so. Yes, just on par with what I normally get, 21. Not bad at all. Okay. Let's see, this is all aside from the benchmarks, the FM radio, task manager, uh, all the things that came with it. Let's note this here as well. Got music player, uh, social hub, music hub. I'll probably remove some of those. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do a quick test of main reloaded. And I'll try my favorite. Let's see how it looks. I'll put it uh, on the side. I don't have it set up because it's not taking my commands. Hopefully I'll be able to move a little bit. Well, it's just taking part of the commands. You see that lagginess that you are seeing there? That's what I mean when I say that every kernel does that except Franco R5. I don't know why. But it starts doing that, like just suddenly starts lagging. Uh, at 1400, which is the stock speed for this phone, 
I normally get about four or five uh, frames per second that I have to uh, that the program skips in order to keep it smooth. When I overclock to 1.6, I rarely have one or two maybe frames skipped, so it's a lot better. But the problem is this. I mean, it's going fine and suddenly it starts to lag. So this is the reason why I always end up using the same kernel. But in any case, it looks to be on par with all the others. It's just that problem with the with the lag uh, on the kernel, and I'll have to play more with it and see all the features. But it seems to be pretty basic. Uh, let's see what it has in the. It has a normal restart. Uh, the theme there, it's all stuck. Okay, no options for recovery or anything like that, and there's no TB, uh, CRT off either. So it's normal there, and decline that because I don't want to do that. And the uh, lock screen, it's the normal swipe, and you have the options to change as well. So, yeah, it looks good, looks fast, it looks very fluid, even though I normally go with Apex Launcher, but this one is very nice too. It just lacks some of the things that I like, like the dock. So, clean note 2.0. Check the link on my description. Thank you.